In today's video, we are going to take a look at my AI email automation setup that is run by GPT-4 agents. This case study is a bit more code heavy, but it's pretty easy to set up and it's fully autonomous. The aim here is to generate leads by running the agents a few times a week. So let's just take a look. First, let's take a look at the case study plan. So it's going to be pretty simple. Just spend an hour a week on this. That's maximum. You're going to send out 30 to 50 cold emails each week. Uh, those are going to be targeted on specific niches. We're going to monitor the response rate. Uh, the monetization is basically just leads. And I think the goal here is just going to be one lead per week because it's, this is cold and it's very hard to perform on that, right? Uh, I'm just going to give it a couple of months to see how this works. And I'm going to do some updates on this channel so, to see the progress of this. Let's just start by demonstrating how this works. So you can see we have this Python code here that is going to run our two agents. So we have the leader agent and we have the data agents. So one of them is just going to instruct the other agents to find contact information from to Chris from All About AI. This is just for a demonstration. Uh, I'm going to send the pre-planned email to the found email addresses and shut down when this is complete. And you can see the data agent is going to have some other assignments. So here you can see it has some functions, so we can search on Google, scrape some URLs, open and save files, and send emails. So you can see the assignment is to find contact information to Chris from All About AI, send the following email to Chris, and here we have our subject line, interview request, generative AI insights. So hi Chris, I'm John from, I just open AI, uh, yeah, and you can say thanks in advance, but you'll be available to do this. I'd be happy to work around this. So basically just a standard email here and shut down when you have complete the steps above. So that is basically our instruction for our agent. So when we head over to the terminal here now, we're just going to run the script. So you can see I will give you assignments. Are you ready? I'm ready to receive assignments. Please proceed. So you can see it starts to search on Google with Chris all about AI content information. I think that's a good idea. And the progress is assignment one initiated. So here we return some results from Google. We found all about AI.com. That's my website. And yeah, you can see it's pretty quick here. So it find my email address. That's good. Yeah, we found the email address here. Perfect. Please proceed to send the second assignment. Use the send email function. And we have email sent successfully. Uh, I need confirmation. Yes, leader agent. The email has been successfully sent you can see i got an email down here now and i'm just gonna shut this down and let's take a look at the email so i hope you can see this but basically here is exactly this email we sent so it's interview request generative ai insights uh hi chris i'm john from open ai blah 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 this i uh, know this is a bit stupid uh, i'm probably gonna remove this uh but yeah basically you can see this is working well and let's move on to our next step and that is going to be to start to generate some leads, so we're going to change up the prompt here, so you can see now I'm going to find the contact information to three interior design companies in London, UK. Send the following email to the found email addresses, and here is kind of our sales pitch, right? Uh, trying to sell some generative AI services, some education, or to teach the company about this. So if this is, sounds interesting to you, please respond to this email. Best regards, Chris, all about AI. I left some links here so they can check out my work. And shut down when you clip completed the steps above. Uh, this is the same for the other agent, so we're just going to instruct that. And yeah, let's see how this is going to go. So let's head over to the terminal and run this. Okay, so that was a success. It actually took some time, but we got there in the end. So just a quick go through here, so you can see it started searching on Google for interior design companies in London. Found some different stuff here, but it couldn't really scrape the website, so it went ahead, found some other strategies. Uh, looked up like company name plus contact info. And it found one here, so it found luxury interior design Chelsea contact katherinepooley.com slash contact. So we went ahead and we found this email address here, enquiries at katrinepooley.com. Here you can see Studio Ashby, Interior Design and Creative Direction. And it found um, info at studioashby.com. Uh, great work. We have successfully obtained email addresses for three design companies in London. Uh, let's move on to the next step. Use the send email function to send the following email to these addresses. So we have the, the subject line and we have our pre-planned email, right? 
and you can see email sent successfully. Uh, there's no way for me to confirm that this email has been opened or something. Uh, I'm just using Mailgun, right? So I can't really, I just have to wait and see if we get any responses. Uh, but this is just a demonstration of how you can use this. And I think it's gonna be really interesting to see how this goes. Uh, if you're interested in this, uh, I have some tutorials on this on my membership. Maybe this is something for you. Uh, I have done this to make newsletters and other stuff too. Uh, but at least this generation, uh, this lead generation tool is gonna be interesting to see if it can pay off. Uh, I'm not gonna run it too much because it can be a bit spammy. So I'm just gonna try to target different companies I wanna contact and just use this to give me some more time. So yeah, that was all we had for today. Uh, I'm gonna do a follow up on this in maybe a few weeks. So watch out for that. Have a great day, thank you for tuning in, and I'll see you again soon.